Thanks, you're a peach. First time in a while that I've had music that loud going on outside. Esplanade at North Gate, Taylor Morrison. I call everything Charlotte Metro, but this is a little closer to Monroe. And this is the Pembroke. This is an active adult neighborhood. I'm on the last, well, you wouldn't know that. You're looking at a Pembroke. Uh, last model, and they've got a model row, which I love. I think people do also. It's not like they don't sell them there at the end. Mm. And this is about the point I get in the day where I'm afraid I'm babbling and I'm saying things over and over again, but I don't know how many videos you've watched. So this is actually a pretty big secondary bedroom, but for the most part in these style neighborhoods, the secondary bedrooms aren't big because they're not important, not even just secondary for kids. Uh, this is going to be people visiting typically, and that's not... A priority for most folks when they move into these style neighborhoods. It's a love for people to come by and visit, no doubt. Who wouldn't? And also, don't fall in love with the model. I haven't said that for years because everybody was just selling inventory, but out here you can buy dirt. Pick out your lot. Pick out all the stuff at their design center. That's gonna make a lot of people happy. I kinda wish all builders would still have that option. I understand why they didn't for a long time. If I can sneak around here and not knock anything down, we're all gonna be happy campers. This is a nice living space. This definitely feels comfortable to me. Hopefully it will to you. Maybe this will be the one you want to bring me out with you. And we all sign on the dotted line. Of course, I only sign once. Quick look in the pantry. I actually think the gal that used to yell at me for not <clears throat> opening up all the doors is either purchased or got tired of following me <laughs> uh. little linen closet here right next to the laundry room I'm gonna go up in that laundry room it's got some neat features I think these features that I'm talking about that you'll see in a model that are additions when you get into the design center. I just think that that doesn't have the wiring in it, folks. That's a little linen closet. I feel very confident. And for whatever reason, that is the door to the garage, but it's full on locked. I mean, with a key, I can't even twist the knob, so. Just picture a garage. Okay, we're gonna do the primary bedroom downstairs here first, and then we're gonna go upstairs for the guest suite. It's the first one I've seen on all their models, so you and I both will have to find out how many of their floor plans have that option. Oh, love a wraparound. Porch. Again, Totally believe this is going to be another addition, another option. Oh, that's one of those, you know, if you've got the money for it, I just, I mean, you know, use your own judgment. If you think you've never used it, don't spend a dime on it. There are just times when you're living down here in the south where you can sit out, you're protected from the bugs, you got the ceiling fans overhead. And it's just very pleasant. And if your neighborhood stays as quiet as it was when I walked out that door, God love you. Oh, excuse me. Master 
closet, not huge. You've heard me talk ad nauseum, hopefully not on this video. Everything's a little bit smaller in these style neighborhoods. You just don't need everything. Let's face it. You're not gonna have kids in this house. Every other bedroom here you can use as a closet. Look how big, this is the biggest master bath I've seen since uh, I got here. Last uh, model home, Pembroke. This might be the reason why you almost never see this. Not even in single family anymore. They're just putting in showers. And not the tubs. closet. All right, boys and girls, we'll see you upstairs. Made it up, made it up. Guest suite in this Pembroke. And I'm excited to find out if they'll have guest suites on all their plans or if this is just going to be the one. As I have gotten differing viewpoints on a lot of these active adult neighborhoods when I go in and uh, I regularly stop by and talk to the on-sites just so I can learn what's going on. Um, I'll be breaking into this, the SRES, Senior Real Estate Expert, or Specialist. What's more popular to them? Because I promise you, <laughs> uh, that's just going to be the furnished door ahead of us. I promise you that uh, they look at the numbers and who's buying what and feedback and, and, and try to make it a better experience for everybody on the next uh, set of folks coming in. I've seen it many times. All these floor plans, that'll be something, but uh, like this will be the Pembroke 2. They really got a lot of feedback on something that needed to be changed that enough people said something about. This is an enormous guest suite upstairs. Boys and girls, I think that's going to do it for the Esplanade and Wayne Taylor. Top of my screen is your buyer's incentive, guys. Don't leave money on the table. Thanks a bunch.